All right, this month on bobbyflay.com, we are talking about clean eating. I'm Sally from the B Team, and I'm here with a savory grain bowl, which is really yummy and definitely trendy. Uh, bowls are having a moment. They um, are on menus everywhere from Chipotle to um, health food restaurants everywhere in between, too. This one that I have here is quinoa, shredded kale, and I have roasted sweet potatoes. So I'll have my quinoa, uh, the shredded kale, and before I add that to the bowl, I will just um, squeeze some lemon juice over it, a little tiny bit of olive oil and some salt, and just give it a, a quick mix with my hands and then add it to the bowl. Um, everything else I just kind of serve at room temperature. When I've pulled it out of the fridge, I just let it come up. Um, so I have the kale, sweet potatoes, some fresh avocado slices, which are really healthy fat, and they help keep you feeling satisfied. And about that tofu, I'm gonna to show you. Um, I, if you're gonna bake it, uh, it's best to use extra firm tofu, which I have here, and it's a one pound block that I have just drained off the water that comes in the box. And then you want to um, press it and wait it for about mm, half an hour is usually good to remove the excess water. So I put my block between two plates and then I weigh it down with a box or two of pasta. And I like using um, a, like a, a box this size because I find that the weight distributes evenly over the block of um, tofu more so than if you were to use like a big heavy can because sometimes it will leave sort of the indentation of the can in the middle. So that's my little tip on weighing down tofu. And you can slice it however you like. Um, I think little cubes are nice. And you can season them however you like them, in about 30 minutes or overnight even, or longer. You, know, you can have them sitting in whatever kind of flavor combination you like. And then um, I roast them in a 400 degree oven uh, for about 45 minutes and I flip them. So what we have here is a vegetarian and really healthy and very satisfying meal. And I think it becomes even more so when I drizzle it with this uh, miso and tahini lemony vinaigrette. It's really yummy and delicious with all sorts of vegetables. My favorite thing to dip in it is the sweet potatoes. It's a really great combination. But however you do it, and again, it's great to have all these on hand. I mean, I just have these containers sitting in my fridge. Um, I think that you'll enjoy getting on the bowl bandwagon. So here's to some healthy eating for January and all of 2015.